All right, have a crack here. Welcome back to the channel. And if you're new here, get a. Don't forget to smash that subscribe and do tell a friend. All right, so we got another TGC Tours designers course. Today's course is Buffalo Point Ranch, and it's designed by TJ Cole 30. All right, so let's get into it. What have we got? Fairways are uh, normal, greens are firm, and green speed is medium. As for the tees, all right, gold tees it is, 6,549 metres. Now, this course was set on hard, so with me playing with the master clubs, it becomes very hard. All right, let's go and have a hack. All right, hole one, par four, not bad, man, not bad. I'm just gonna read a little bit of his description here. It says, this beautiful golf club is a par 70, 7,152 yard beauty ripped straight out of the Rocky Mountains. Holes 1, 2, 3, 9 and 18 play around Buffalo Lake with the threat on water on every hole. So you'd better hit straight. <laughs> yeah, it's not going to happen, man. It's not going to happen. All right, so let's get into it. Let's just let's just zoom out here on Buffalo Lake. And yeah, let's just have a little bit of a look around here. So what do we got? Oh, we got a lighthouse here on the lake. First one I've ever seen the lake, but hell, it kind of suits it, doesn't it? All right. Yeah, not bad. I see the course going around the lake. Oh, check out that. Oh, there's a massive waterfall up the back there as well. That is cool. Yeah, he's got a bit of a clubhouse over here. Actually, let's just wander over to this clubhouse. So, what your clubhouse here, man? you got all this beautiful planting on the back here around the lake and everything. I think the clubhouse just needs something around it. Just to take away that sort of plainness of it. Yeah, that would look really cool. Maybe just a bit of a hedge work up there. Maybe sort of like up on just the left-hand side of it here on the hill there near the fairway. Something like that. Anyway, let's get back to it. Where are we? Aimed right out in the middle of the lake. Yeah, we're not going swimming yet. So, where are we at? 7k winds. Yeah, I reckon about there. Alright, so let's just see how I swing. Oh, that was a pretty damn well perfect swing. I like your tees too, the, the skulls. I really feel that this um, game needs to add more to the designing aspect. I'm not, I don't go in there designing, but just from what I've seen and everything. Like, take for instance the... Um, people that like designing fantasy courses and like like sort of like a Halloween themed courses I should say themed courses man you could they could benefit so much if they added that kind of stuff to the game oh man imagine what the, some of the designers would come up with it would look awesome like little pumpkin things and spooky lamp posts and stuff I reckon it'd be awesome all right so with that with enough uh, that out of the way so what do we got 132 to the pin 124 carry with the pigeon reg. Okay. Oh. I think I might go the 9 iron on this. Because I really don't want to come up too short. So if we go the 9. Actually, no hell. You know what? I'm going to bring that back. I'm going to play the pigeon wedge. And I'm going to add a bit of low loft to it. Alright, let's see how this goes. Oh, I've lost it in the sun. I think it's right of the pin. Oh, hang on. Sit down, baby. Sit right there. That's not bad. That is not bad. I'm happy with that. Alright, so about, about there. Oh, <laughs> you're joking. You are joking. I can't believe that. I cannot believe that. Alright. Get in the hole. Oh, come out with a little par anyway. It's better than a bogey, I guess. All right, that was hole one. Okay. Hole two, par four. Small little fairway to land on here. So let's see what happens. Oh, there's a pin there. Just to the left, up on the hill. Okay, so what do we got? Driver, no. We're definitely going to drop back three wood on this one. And yeah, let's just probably get a nice swing again. Well, that was pretty damn good. I'm happy with that. I think my, my little man's happy too. Okay, so 112 with 9 up to the pin. Rightio. 124, wow. Okay. 
Hmm. I think I might play the Gappy on this one. Let's go the El Gappy. And put a little bit of low loft on it. Alright. Oh, a bit of a fast. That wind's going to... It's pushing right. That wind definitely helped it. So we're just on the fringe, are we? Ooh, that's a hard call, that one. Oh, no, we're on the green. So we've got a downhill part breaking to the right. I kind of don't want to hit this too hard, but I know medium speed on the green. I'm going to have to give it a little bit. Oh, probably a bit more than that. Oh, hang on. Oh, hang on. Oh, yeah, baby. That is a birdie. Beautiful. And you can see that waterfall in the background. That looked awesome. All right, hole three, par three, smashing across the corner of the lake here. So this could be quite interesting, I think. All right, let's go for it. So we got 219 to the pin. 20. Wow, okay, that's going in the rough if I use that. So I'm going to have to go to the two iron. 8K wins. Okay, about there, possibly. The old two, just tiniest little bit of high loft. What's it, is it coming round? It's coming round. Oh, that's it. That's it. Just keep rolling. Come on. Go. Come on. Come on. Come on. <laughs> well, that's not too bad. Not too bad. Hopefully I can set this up for a nice little par. Or hell, even get this one in, but I doubt it. Um, Alright, so... Doesn't look like it's doing anything near the... Near the um, cup there. Not sure. I can't quite see it. So I reckon about, about there... Get in. Get, oh, you're joking. That was so close. Missed it by that much. All right, so we come out with a nice little par there and a beautiful view. That was a nice view, that. All right, hole four, par four. Wow, this looks like a long par four. Okay. So 7k wins out that way. Just gonna aim it about here. He's looking hard. Needs his glasses on. Alright. Got the prescription sunnies on. <laughs> um, alright, so 194, 8 up to the pin. Okay, so that takes it up. that's in the 200 bracket. 205 with the two iron. Oh, we're gonna have to get the two, I think. Let's put a um, bit of high loft on this one. Still got the high loft? Yep, alright, let's go. Oh, and a slow. That is pushing hard to the right. And we've overshot the mark by heaps. Yeah, I sort of changed up my clubs. I got rid of the three iron, but now I kind of want it back. <laughs> Man, you can't have your cake and eat it too with this game. Okay, so oh, this is a big putt here. 16 metre putt. Okay, so it is breaking all to the left. It's downhill as well. I'm going to aim out here somewhere and see what happens. Might be too far. Ooh, I don't think I've given it enough. No, I haven't. Still not too bad. Just need that little bit more power on that one. Oh, so what, this is for par. Oh no. Oh no. Get in. Oh, thank you, ball. Thank you. All right, so remaining one under coming into hole five, which is another little par three. All right. Oh, look at all the rock work there. There's some big rocks. That's a, that's a cliff. All right, just here, man. Just here, dude. 
just in front of this before it steps up to that first tier. Maybe chuck in a few rocks across there or something like that, maybe and just sort of follow the contour of it. And just a couple of your bushes. That look that would look really nice in there, I reckon. Just to give it that get rid of that plain sort of uphill look to it. So Alright, what have we so what have we got here? Oof, 192 with 15 up. So what's that? That's 207. 205, okay, here we go. The old two iron again. It's coming in quite handy actually on this course. Alright, let's go. Oh, it's going straight at it. Oh, it's just going to keep... Yeah, damn. That was coming on hot, too. Um, it's kind of probably a good thing it did um hit there and kick a bit. Okay, so this is all downhill. Going left, right, left, and then right again. Okay, so I think I might just pretty much hit it straight at it and see what happens. How's it going? It's going, it's going. It is gone. What a putt. What a putt. Alright, two under. Hell yeah. Okay, hole six, par four. Wow, do not get a slow swing on this because, hell, I think we might be on the edge of the earth here. All the boundaries. What do we got down there? Whoa, that just steps off. Oh, yeah, it is too. Look, that's no man's land down there. All right. So let's just line this back up. Okay, about there. Give us a little bit of leeway, leeway each way in case I have a bad swing, which is probably going to come. Yep, and look at that. Slow. Oh, no. Oh, no, that's all right. That'll be on the fairway. What am I worried about? Okay, so 98 with 4 up. Alrighty oh. So it's at 102. I reckon old Sandy will be pretty good on this one. Got a little bit of wind holder up. Probably could have added a little bit of low loft to that. The wind's probably going to hold it up a bit. Yeah, it's not too bad. A little bit of low loft might have got a little bit closer to the cup. Okay, so again slightly to the left and then barreling down towards the right slight up then down too oh is that going is that going is that going oh you're kidding i thought that was going for sure all right so we'll tuck that one away for a nice little par anyway okay yeah i'm enjoying it so far man i'm enjoying it Always do. I said it a million times. I love this game. I don't know what it is. All right, hole seven, par five. Let's just see where this one's going. Looks like maybe a bit of a dog leg to the left here. Let's just see where it pops out. And there it is. All right, let's go. Whoa, what's going on with the camera? All right, about there. Almost got a fast, man. I could have sworn I would have got a slow on that one. So hard to judge the Master Club. I, I don't know how people do it. Just like swing after swing after swing. It, it amazes me. Okay, so... Ooh, we could possibly... Ooh, draw, go for the three wouldn't get there. It's ten down to the pin. No, that's no, 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 no. Okay, so I'm drop, I'm gonna pull that back to four iron on this one. I reckon the four will be good. I love the irons. I like swinging with the irons for some reason. I have a better strike rate, I reckon, with the um, irons than what I do with the driver and the wood. Okay, so forty-four to the pin, thirty-nine carry. Got the old. Pitching wedge, going to flop it onto the green. <laughs> well, that was a fast. I felt that. I flicked that pretty quick. Oh, just stop, baby. Stop. I should have allowed for that. Damn it. Okay, so... 
I'm already about, about there, I reckon. What do you reckon, about there? Yep, okay, let's go. Oh, that, that hardly moved at all. That hardly moved. I thought that was going to just sort of dip in at the end there. Anyway, coming up with a par. I'm happy. Okay, hole eight, par three. All right, so we got 169 with 12 down. So. Now, so 157. 157. Alright, so I think the seven irons they go for this one. And we'll just put a bit of high loft on it. Okay. Oh, slight fast. That wind might keep it in check though. That's not too bad. That is not too bad. I'm happy with that. Par threes have been killing me lately, so you think it'd be the easiest one, but oh, I, I struggle with them sometimes. And another little birdie, ripper. All right, three under. Okay, hole nine, par four. Where the hell is this one going? Is this the hole with the where I was talking about in the clubhouse and that rock? Yeah, it is too. All right. Okay. So, what have we got here? Wow, sixty-six meters down to the pin. AK wins. All right. What do you reckon about there with the driver? If we go back a club, possibly there. All right. Now let's change the driver and let's go for it. I think this will be pretty good. It's going to take a while for the ball to go down. Yep. A bit of crap on the um, tee box there. There we go. That's that's not a bad hit, actually. I was kind of hoping I'd get over all those rocks and everything. Alright, so that's left us with 95 to the pin. So 99 carry. I think I might go with the lob wedge on this one. To be honest, let's put a little bit of low loft on it. Aim out here to account for that little bit of wind. Oh, here we go. Is it going to have the. Oh, here we go. That's not bad. Not bad. I'm happy with that. No, I love the planting. Look at that. That shot right there with the planting. The back of the green or anything, that looks cool. Looks very nice, man. The trees off in the distance. Alright, um, yeah, so downhill part. Oh, I've done it again! So it's either one of two things, I'm even too, either aiming too far out or hitting too far, too hard. Not allow, not allowing it to, um, come in. All right, there we go. Yeah, it definitely looks like it's going to um curve off more than what it does. All right, hole ten, par four. Where's this one headed? Where are we going here? Sort of paths going off everywhere there. Um, all right. All right, there it is. Okay. So, 7k wins, yeah, possibly about there, and hopefully I don't get a fast. No, total opposite actually, that's got to be in a bunker. No, in the thick stuff, oh, that was a, that was a really bad tee off that one. Alright, so we're in, definitely in the thick stuff here. Oh no, alright, I'm going to 2. Oh, I don't, oh, 
I'm going to forget the two. So I'm coming out of the thick. I could check up, but I'm not going to. I'm going for it. Oh, I probably should have pulled up. Oh, I should have pulled up. <laughs> Straight to the bunker on that one. Okay. So we're going to write this hole off. Nice hole, man, but yeah, it's just, just me. It's not you, it's me. <laughs> um, okay, so let's pull a little bit of power out of this one. Well, that looked a hell of a lot closer than what it was from the bunker, didn't it? Alright, so breaking to the left, uphill putt. I'm probably going to aim too far out again. Oh, no, it just crept on the inside this time. Yeah, I don't know either, mate. I have no idea. I'm lost. I can never get it right. Anyway, that is a bogey. Oh, dearie, dearie me. All right, what a way to start the back nine. All right, hole 11, par 5. Okay, we're going back now, I see. I see what's going on. This path here, man, it's... A lot of there's a lot of paths just veering off everywhere. Like, or maybe make it just a single path all the way along, and then it could have then it could have split down here, down at the end here, or near the water, or something like that. So yeah, and then you could have crossed your fairway there. Never been a really big fan of paths crossing the fairway. I've seen it on um, real courses before, but yeah, it's not not my thing. I don't know why. Just it's just one of those little things, I guess. Everyone's got one. Um, Alright, so let's go there. A slow again. Here we go. Oh, well, that's alright. That's on the fairway still. Not too bad. Like I did say, it was a hard course. It turns very hard for me when I'm playing with these clubs. Oh, I don't know if I want to go for that. I'm going to pull it back. I'm definitely pulling back. I'm going to go the four iron. Way I've been swinging the last few holes. Oh, I should have went for it. Should have went for it. Alright, so that's left us with what? 87 one up, so 88. Okay. Oh, lob wedge. I reckon this will be pretty good. We've got a little bit of wind to hold us up as well. Let's put the Tad has been a high, high loft on it. Slight fast, that's going to push left. Definitely had the distance, just wasn't straight enough. Alright, so breaking left. And slightly right at the end there. Yeah, get in the hole. <laughs> oh, yeah. Is that a birdie? Hell, yeah, it was. All right, three under overall. Okay, hole 12, par four. There's the pin down the end. Let's go. Okay, no, yep. Straight down the guts. That's my plan. We've got hazards left and right, which are definitely in play, depending on how you swing. I'm planning on getting a nice straight swing. Straight ish, anyway. That should be on the fairway, so yeah, I'll be happy with that. Alright, ooh, very short green. We're gonna have to pull up quick here. Oh, look at the wind, too. That wind is just picking up even more. So we've got 88 with three up to the pin with the lob wedge. Yep, lob wedge it is. Alright. High loft. Let's go. And fingers crossed. Actually, that's not too bloody bad. So, a bit of a downhill to the right putt. Okay, downhill left. I 
Is it going to come around? Is it going to come around? Oh, you're kidding me? Are you serious? Fancy twirl, though. Fancy twirl. Alright. About there. Get it in the hole. Alright, so was it that was a par. I'm sure it was. Alright, so remaining three under. Hole thirteen. Par four. Where the hell's this one going? So this is this is gonna spin around to the right here, look at this. And is it gonna pop out through the trees? There it is. Okay. So this is par four. Now do I play the three wood there? Or do I go the driver and try and swing it right around the corner? Hmm. What do I do? You know what? Just for the hell of it, I think I might go for it with the driver. So let's go out there. Alright, so, and we're going to need possibly about that much fade? Maybe that much? Yeah, that much? Probably about that. I'll just bring it around just a little bit more. Okay, let's, let's try this. Let's see how we go. Got a fast. Oh, that could be in the thick stuff, I think. Yes, it is. Oh, that's that ball's gone. That's gone. Oh, I've lost it. <laughs> had to try, though. I had to try that. I don't know why. I could have played safe, but no. Nah. All right, so we can't even see where we're going now. Ah, yep, trees in the way. Rightio. Nine iron. Let's jump that up. Eight. Let's go again. Let's go to seven. I, oh, hang on. I've seen a club. I've seen a club. Right, I can see me swing. Okay, there it is. Very slow. Oh, hang on. But we got the green. Have we? Yes, we have. What a recovery shot to make the green out of all that crap back there. <laughs> that was purely my bad, though. You could have played that safe easily. Still there in two, though. Um, alright, so downhill part. I don't know why I'm going to that view. I hate that view on the green. Oh, definitely punch that. It's not going to be enough, though. Oh, de oh actually, it definitely had the power. Probably too much power there. Uphill. Get in the hole. Get in the hole. Hell yes. Another little par. Alright. Purely because of um, that tee off. <laughs> yeah, that's enough of that though. Okay. Hole 14. Par 3. Oh, here's this big waterfall, man. That looks nice. That looks very cool, man. I do not mind that at all. All the planting and everything. Alright. So. Let's just. What have we got up here? Hang on a minute, hang on a minute. What do we got here? So does your path disappear into the rock or are we or do you walk across that rock? I don't know. That looks cool, that looks cool. Man just needs a little adjustment just there. Especially if you if you're ever to enter um into design courses, they'll they'll pick you to pieces for that, I reckon. Yeah, just maybe maybe um, a wooden bridge? That'd be cool. Railing and stuff. That'd be very cool. All right. Anyway, let's get back to it. Let's see if we see how we go on this one. So what are we playing here? 14 up to the pin. Okay. So that's definitely in the 133. No, sorry. No. 143. Sorry. 143. What was I thinking? 147. All right. Let's put a bit high loft on this sucker. Allow for the wind. A bit high loft. Alright. Oh, that was a pretty good swing. Not too bad. I'm quite happy with that. Yeah, I'm, I'm happy with that. So if you got a fast or a slow, oh, I'd hate to see where that goes. Okay. 
Okay, so, ooh, bit of a putt here, nine metre putt. I'm breaking to the left all the way by look at this, and playing uphill. I'm going to aim out here a bit, a bit more, yep, and give it to it. Oh, it's going to be too fast. Stop there, stop there, stop there. Oh yeah, hate those putts because if you miss and you hit it too fast, well, you're in a world of trouble. Okay, so. Get in the hole. Alright. Hell yes. Nice little par. So, I don't know, he's still three under. Okay, not the flashiest rounds, but, you know, I do like to think that I represent just the average player. Alright, hole 15. Par 5. I'm going to climb across the rocks and the bridge. And where's this one going? This is not a bad looking hole, man. I like this one. This is nice. Alright, there it is. All the way at the end there. Okay, so 7 k's. Yep. I reckon about there. That's a pretty damn good swing. So we're going to have the three wood. How far is this going to take us? Oh yeah, well, let's go. Let's go for it. I can handle it if I land in the rough. But I'm going to try and nail it. Oh, slight fast. That is... Yep, that's in the rough. Unless we get a lucky bounce. Nope. No such luck. I like trying to nail that thin fairway, fairway if you can nail it, it's like, oh yeah. <laughs> um, Alright, so we've got 43 with 3 up, so 46 of the pin, 39 carry, coming out of the rough. Pitching wedge 99, well, no, 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 no. Alright, middle low loft. Oh, and a very fast. Are you serious? I guess it is, but how could that be so far? Yeah, anyway, let's keep going. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> oh, I'm... I'm falling apart. I'm slowly falling apart. Alright, it's getting late. I'm hungry. <laughs> okay, so what are we up to now? Hole 16, par 3. Oh, wow, big elevation change here. Oh, look at that, look at that, um... That's not too bad. That's cool. I like the how the water's like... It's almost like a... almost kind of looks like a glass cabinet, doesn't it? Let me come back if we can get back down here. Oh no, it's, it's, it's bricks. Okay, I see. That's cool. That is very nice. I like that. First time I've ever seen something like that. Okay, so what do we got? 123 down. Okay, so... Uh, 20, 30, actually, 130 to be pretty much exact. 135? Okay. Let's go with that. Put a bit of high loft on it. And yeah, I think I think we'll be right to go. Take a while to come down. It's looking good from here. Right of the pin. Slightly overshot it, but I kind of expected that. I'm going too far out. I do this all the time, don't I? And I've hit that too hard. Not even going to give it a chance to come in. Oh, I did at the end there, but not enough. Yes, I think my judgment of putting has like been way off so far tonight. Just, oh, I just can't get the can't get it. All right, hole 17, par four. Heading back down the hill. Let this one fly along here. Oh, 
All right, here we go. Let's go for it. So this is like 27 down. Oof, got the wind as well. What do you reckon about there, possibly? Maybe even there. I've got a feeling I'm going to go right and into the rough, but hell, let's just see how we go. Got a fast that's going to hold it pretty well straight. I'm worried about that bunker down there. Oh no, what was I worried about there? We did go off to the right and in the rough, like I thought it would. Alright, so two down. Flopping, let's pull out the gap wedge. Just give it a nice damn hit with the gappy. That's not too bad. I think we can work with that. It's a nice view across your lake, dude. I like that. Across the old Buffalo Lake. Down you go. Thank you. Alright, that's a birdie. Okay, four under. Yeah, not too bad. I'm sure, um... It'll come out in the comments. People are absolutely smashing this course. As in the way of score, I mean, that is. Alright. Yep, about... Yeah, let's go. About there. So we got hole 18. Par 4. Last hole. Okay, I thought I would have went towards the clubhouse, but that's alright. I'm just going to have to walk all the way back. Alright, so that has left us with 94 to the pin. 99 carry, got the sandwich. I think we'll drop back to the lob wedge on this one. Tad us a little bit high aloft. I don't know why I do it, but it just makes me feel better. <laughs> and we get that wind to contend with, so this is going to send it skyward. It's probably going to go right of the pin. Yeah, it is. That's not too bad. Probably a bit of low loft would have been better. Alright, so. Well, it's breaking hard at the left of the end. Well, it looks like it is anyway. My judgment has been pretty well off tonight. Oh! I thought that was going. I thought that was in for sure. Alright. Little. Pa, hopefully. Okay. Not too bad, oh, I need a new chair, it's a bit creaky. Alright, so what do we end up with? Four under overall. Not too bad, not the flashiest round, but I've got some tiger pants, hell yeah. Alright, well there you have it, Buffalo Point Ranch. And that was designed by TJ Cole, 30. Well done man, it's not a bad course, didn't mind it, didn't mind it. It was a little bit challenging, but yeah, especially with me playing with the Master Clubs. Yeah, I will favour that, as I always do. I'll probably come back on that, take the missus around it or something like that, see how she goes. And I'll give that a five stars, mate. Well done, dude. Well done. Thanks for another course, anyway. That's what I like, to hit a new course every day. It's absolute, I love it. I love it. I can't get enough of it. I'm always on the tours at work, checking out all the new courses and all the courses in, um, in production or... In work, the work in progress, so yeah, I'm always snooping around out there, checking out all the awesome photos. So yeah, your course might be next. It might not be the flashiest round, but I do like to play. So anyway, that's me done for another night. I'm out, so yeah, I'll catch you hopefully next time, somewhere on a green or a fairway and not the thick shit or anything like that. <laughs> Alright, I'm out. Later.